uh, that sit on this committee uh, and and for that matter on intelligence committee w one of the things and I and I, I this is not something that's a huge part of this budget but you, you know there's money that goes to uh, assistance uh, to the Palestinian Authority and the payments that have been made over the years uh, from some of that money to the Palestinian Liber uh, Liberation Organization that they use to pay families of suicide bombers uh, I, I tell you that's like great on a blackboard uh, as far as uh, a lot of us are concerned. Um, I'm sure that's on your radar, and I realize that there's other sides of that uh, as far as those payments uh, into, the, uh, into the West Bank or, or, or into uh, Gaza, but this is something that, uh, that really galls on us, and anything you can do about that uh, would, be, would be greatly appreciated. Well, let me assure you, Senator, it, it was discussed directly uh, when uh, President Abbas made his visit with his delegation to Washington, the president raised it, but then I had a bilateral, much more detailed bilateral with him later that day, and I told him, you absolutely must stop making payments to family members of, quote, martyrs. I said, it's one thing to help orphans and, and children, but when you designate the payment for that act, that has to stop. They have changed their policy, at least I have been informed they've changed that policy and they are, their intent is to cease the payments uh, to the family members of those who've committed murder or violence against others. Uh, so it is, we've been very clear with them that this is simply not acceptable uh, to us. It is certainly not acceptable to the American people. Well, and Mr. Abbas probably has something to say about the West Bank, but you get deep into Gaza, I don't know how much influence he's got there. Well, and I would say in Gaza, we are working with others who have provided assistance and funding into Gaza, uh, much of which is, as you know, it's to relieve the humanitarian problem, rebuilding homes, hospitals, schools, but there's always a lot of leakage of that money. Yeah. And so we're working carefully with others as to how, how do you help. And the Israeli government is supportive of stabilizing Gaza by providing these type of humanitarian actions. We just can't have the money leaking in to the hands of those who, are, who would commit violence with it. Thanks for the job you're doing. Thank you, Mr. Chair. Thank you. I do